This is Samyang's first ever zoom lens, a full frame 24 to 70 mil f2.8 workhorse of a lens for Sony E-mount. Now the first thing you'll notice when you get this lens in your hands is the build quality. It really feels like a premium piece of glass. Now this one is a pre-production model, so optically it might not all be there, but aesthetically it feels very much like a, like a polished product. It comes with a price tag that pretty much beats any of the full frame 24 to 70 mil contenders out there. Now, the nine aperture blades create a smooth and natural bokeh. And with it being an f2.8 lens, you can create some lovely shallow depth of field. Now, this lens is parfocal, which is incredibly useful for those video shooters. You can zoom in, focus, and then zoom out knowing that the focus is still going to be bang on. Now the minimum focus distance is 35 centimeters, so you can get relatively close to your subject, and it's pretty on par with its more expensive counterparts. It weighs just over a kilogram, putting it slightly on the heavier end of the spectrum for a lens of this focal range, but the unit is weather sealed, so shooting out in challenging conditions shouldn't really be an issue at all. Now if I tip the lens, you can see that there's absolutely no lens creeping going on here. I have to apply some force to get that lens to move, which is why you won't see a lens lock on there, so that's quite neat. Now the resistance in the zoom ring is constant, and it does feel very robust. Now I found the autofocus performance for stills to be very fast and accurate. For the video user, I really like how quiet the AF is, and with Samyang's linear stepping motor technology, you can really pull off some smooth autofocus pulls, even shooting bare bones handheld. Now on the side, there is a custom mode switch. And by default, this is set to control the focus ring on the lens. Mode one allows you to control the focus, whilst mode two allows you to control the aperture. And these custom modes can be configured from a computer using the Samyang lens station. You can also adjust the focus throw, which is incredibly useful from a filmmaking perspective, along with the ability to fine tune the AF and do firmware updates. This is an exciting leap for Samyang, after 50 years of producing optics for creatives, this is the first of, I'm sure, many versatile, but also incredibly well-priced zoom lenses. If you have any questions, then do just put them in the comments and I will get back to you. And if you want to find out some more information, just head over to the Holden website. Thanks for watching.